hey now welcome to my channel thank you so much for dropping in to hang with me for a bite day three post tooth pull i got me some uh chocolate nestle quick i'm so tired of soup and jello y'all so i made some soft scrambled eggs i don't like plain scrambled eggs it's, it's the consistency for me but i didn't want to put any extra stuff in it like spinach when I usually do my omelets spinach and cheese so I just um, yeah put a little bit of garlic a little bit of parsley and I'm about to put some ketchup because of course hot sauce would tear my mouth apart yes it would I know not to chew on that side. I'm used to not chewing on that side, but you never know what spreads through your mouth. And I have a nice, plain piece of sourdough bread. <laughs> oh, y'all. Take a bite. Suffer with me. <laughs> oh. Out. Too big of a bite. I don't know who will make it with the bread. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to take small bites, but I'm hungry. Yeah, I can't live on soup and jello. The first day I just had two things of jello. And then the second day, which was yesterday, I had couple things of soup and some more jello two more things of jello so today I upgraded to some scrambled eggs to fill my belly uh-oh This don't bother me. And of course you can't use a straw or anything after you get your tooth pulled. This is crap, y'all. This is crap. I just wanted to let y'all know I'm doing okay I'm not in any pain um if I feel a little twinge I'll take some Tylenol the bleeding has stopped of course um it's still soft very soft in there so I'm not messing with it and just following directions on what I'm supposed to do so I'll catch y'all on the next one um Stay safe and all that jazz. <laughs> like the video. And if you like the video, you probably won't. I don't mind. Ouch. See y'all on the next one. Bye-bye.